Hi everybody, it's Diane. Well, I'm just here to kind of show you how I created the new pattern that I've got going here for my globes. Um, we can create any color we want. If you know your color um, scale for blending, uh, red and yellow makes orange. That's how I made the orange one. And I fused a yellow and blue one to make the green one. I can fuse a blue and green one to make a teal one and so on and so forth. I got a red one and a blue one fused together to make the purple one. So you can make all kinds of colors, including um, all the way to black. Um, so just have fun playing with colors, but I wanted to talk about the light display and how I created my pattern. So I just wanted to show you how I create that pattern. So you can choose your globe and you can choose the light pattern for that globe. So I have um, this globe and this globe have the same sequence. So the light sequence you see here for this one is the same I have for this one. So when they're on, it kind of goes in sequence, okay? So light sequence is one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. I've got all seven lit up here. That means this first light comes on first. And then this sequence at the bottom row is the same sequence for all of them. They all have this flash on and off sequence. Okay, so then the number two globes, um, his light, he's not lit when this first one comes on, but he comes on second. And so I count seven, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and then off. So everybody's gonna have this light off and the rest of these are going to go kind of in order. This is number two, so I make sure that number two is lit, but not number one. And then the third one, I make sure that number three is lit, but not the first two. And then the rest of this pattern is the same. And then the same for number four. One, two, three, four is lit and the rest as in the first one. And then the sequence on the bottom is the same. So I did that same sequence. So number four would be the number four here, duplicating so they just kind of meet in the middle. Um, and then number five, same. We're gonna count five, one, two, three, four, and five. And then this, the sequence is the same. Number six, so we've got one, two, three, four, five. Number six is lit up, but not the first five. And then same, the red one, the seventh one. One, two, three, four, five, six. Seven is lit up. This one is not, and this sequence is the same. So that's how I created this light pattern. Following, this is a one, two, three, four, five, six, and then seven in the middle. So I just wanted to share that with you if you wanted to have fun or some ideas on how to create some light patterns. This might give you some good ideas. Um, but that's it for now. Have fun playing with globes. Uh, the little fuser here is how you will conjure up. I've got one conjuring right now, so I'm not going to speed him up. But have fun. I will talk to you guys later. Um, I'll look forward to seeing some of your light designs. Just let me know. I'll check them out. See ya.